good news. My mic is working amazing. And so, now starts the next episode. Hello everybody, this is the Lego Kid 57 here, coming at you with another episode of my Starbound Let's Play. <laughs> I just realized that this ship is kind of in the shape of a castle. That makes perfect sense since I am a robot. What all good sh people should do is throw all the coal they have earned into the fuel tank of the stuff. Okay, so we're going back to the planet. And warping, we're gonna warp to the planet. Now, daytime, I'm gonna get rid of some of these blocks right here and start making my little base because it's obviously the thing I want to do right now. And at night, I will go down into mine. So if you're wondering, to mine the background, it is right click, to mine the foreground is to left click. You understand what the foreground is, it's the front blocks. Like... Like, if these blocks are like behind me and I can go up with these blocks that is the foreground and this is obviously the background because it's behind me makes perfect sense doesn't it? I thought so okay the funny thing is pick t pickaxes wear out but axes you can use them forever and they won't wear out I've never had time to upgrade my axe though on my uh, non-recording world um, so yeah I will try hard well really I really don't care about it cause um, I have another world that I started so this will be all recording world so everything you see in this video will be done in this video. It won't be done off cam. Makes sense? I thought so. Um, first things first. I'm not gonna say that. We're gonna build our lovely abode. Um, if you want to know how to place one block at a time, you uh, shift click. Um, at this moment, I'm pretty sure you can't um, switch keys. It's kind of annoying because some of the keys are like all the way across the keyboard. Um, but it does help for those of you who are watching. So you can figure out what the keys are. And say that might be enough. 
Hopefully it is. I'm hoping it is. And we're gonna make a door here. First of all, we gotta open and place the thing, the frame down, you know. Because the, there needs to be a certain amount of space for the door to go in. And you can't put it without a overhang block, I guess is what you can call it. Did I craft one? No, I didn't. And here is our first door. Nice, huh? We're gonna make a second door, just cause we can, and it's also very helpful to have another door. I need to access the crafting table. Another door! And this one will be placed right there when I can. Oh, that's right. I'm standing on it. And we are going to... Move their wagon over there because we don't want to just like get rid of their stuff. Oh no, we're nice people and we're keeping it there. Uh, for now, we're just gonna roof this off here and actually, we're gonna craft some platforms. did not make extra too many because we're gonna have that as steps. Genius thinking, huh? Um, yeah. And then we go down here. And that's our mine. <sighs> I don't wanna have these blocks here. And I am going to do some special work. going the whole way up, but yeah, kind of get my picture. Okay, I will need some more wood. That requires cutting down more trees. And more trees gives more wood. I put doors on both sides, because if I expand upwards, it's kind of hard to jump over. Look, we found surface coal. The kind of coal I like. I know we mine pretty slow. Um, actually, I heard in the future that they're going to be getting rid of the picks altogether. And they will be um, adding in upgrades to the matter manipulator. So, in that case, there has to be a way you can get more matter manipulators. Because if you were to lose the one you have by dying, there's no way you can get more stuff. So, that'll be something we'll see in the future, I guess. And so, we don't want to deal with these guys while we're trying to chop down our wood peacefully. I know it's their home planet and they want to try to protect it, but I need to live around here too. I'll be nice to their planet and replant all the trees that I get out just to be helpful. And so, once we get this one, I'm pretty sure we'll have enough wood for what I'm going to do next. Welcome, come in. Oops, wrong thing. Come in. I'm so hungry. Ow. 
so hungry. I'm just gonna eat your meat up. Oh, you're so delicious. I should have you over for more meals. <laughs> if you catch my drift. I should have you for dinner more times. Have you for dinner. Okay, now I'm gonna have plenty of wood for this next project. I'm gonna just go to sleep in this lovely wagon here. And as we're sleeping, we'll think on what to do next. Hmm, what are we gonna do next? Well, obviously, I know one thing we can do. Finish this house. And one way to do that is just finish by putting the wall in. What do you know? We don't have enough. So we're gonna take the seven wood we got and craft the rest of it. Because obviously this is not enough. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to cut down a tree or two. Oops. I kind of miscalculated. Oh well. Okay, that's nine logs. That should be good enough. First, before I start that one, let's see. How many logs does it take to make a hoe? <laughs> and you know, it doesn't take that many. But we're talking about the stone kind. Okay, that's better. You know what, I'm just gonna make this easy for both me and me. Even line right here. So, uh, makes people with obsessing Obsessive compulsion disorder, not so obsessive or compulsive, and they might just have a disorder. Nah, we don't even want that either. So, our quest is to get stuff to make a hoe because hoes are nice sometimes. Um, yeah. I'm just dancing around here. Um, I don't like the night. Um, I guess maybe every episode might be a day and a night. That's probably what I might do. I mean, if I go mining and just lose track or visit a new planet and the time starts all over, uh, that's the only thing I see different in it. But, yeah. A day and a night sounds like a good episode time. You sound like a horse. And you s Just make that sound again if you're saying thank you. In five, four, three, two, one, now. You're, you're welcome. So I got some more. Let's get ourselves the achievement. 
good job. You'll need a whole bunch of iron bars to craft an anvil. Accept reward. Your ship's engine isn't yet strong enough to take you beyond the Alpha Sector. Craft a distress beacon and maybe you'll be able to make contact with a larger ship. Make sure you're ready for anything before you do. Make sure you're ready for anything before you do, though. Okay, I accept the challenge. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Challenge accepted. Okay, anyways. Oh my goodness, my ship is leaking. My ship is leaking. The whole worth of the world has come to an end. <laughs> oh. No, I can't live like this anymore. Why? Why must it be this way? Why? Why must it be this way? Hey, hey, hey! Oh no! Oh no! I don't know why I'm kind of singing like this. I'm sure you hate me for doing this. We're gonna smelt this copper like this. And then we're gonna grab it and then we can see what we can make like this anyway. Hey, hey. I'm ducking and I'm jumping and I'm going round and round. I'll stop now. You want the song? You can buy it on iTunes. I'm just kidding. I have no... I'm... I'm not, I'm not gonna sell the song. Besides, nobody would buy it. It's a terrible song. I don't know. In the comments below, tell me how, what you thought of my song. Before I die of this raining asteroids, raining satellites. Before this episode comes to an end, I want to make. I did a quick look see at my little friend here. You go hit the field button. Um, this is what we call our. Okay, we've got one we can't land on. One that is a snow, and one that is a moon. I uh, hate moons, you can't breathe on those. It's kind of oxygen deprived. Uh, asteroid field can't land. A moon, another arid. A big asteroid field, oh my goodness, that's like the biggest asteroid field I ever, ever seen. And a huge desert. Um, that was that one. This one has a pretty big asteroid field. Um, there's a lot of asteroid fields in this galaxy. And we can also land on the sun, I'm just kidding. Um, obviously we want to set our home to that planet. Oh, set home. That's what we want to do first. Because we obviously can't go to a home that we haven't set. Yeah. So, I'm going to see how it's going down on planet Amazing. Okay, it's a brand new day on Planet Amazing, and an amazing song is playing. This song is the song they used for the game trailer, and personally I think it's a good song. Um, we're gonna sleep. I think this song is called Walk on a Beach, on the beach, because I got an instrument on my other world. Oops. And it plays this song, and that's what it's called. 
So, before I start my exploration and go any further, we are gonna end this episode off here. So, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And we will see you all again for some more videos. And, like always, I'm going to end this episode in my spaceship. I don't know why I was talking like that, but okay. I'm putting just stuff I don't want to hold on to right now in here. I'll deal with those later once I get a chest of some sort, some kind. I don't know. Whatever comes first. But, I hope you all enjoy this episode. See you. I'll see you guys later in the next video. Hopefully, hopefully this series will get a good, a good rating on it. I guess I will upload my first video today. That sounds like a good idea. See what the people think of it. Starting a new series. Maybe I'll upload the videos within a day or two when I make them. Cause that'd be good. Because like literally. Every series I've done, I haven't done that. Enough with this talk. We're gonna end this episode, like I said, and do the following: what I always say: rate, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to share that video. Love it if you share it to people and you spread the word around about my channel. If you like it, if you like it that much, please do. That would help me a lot. Thank you. Goodbye.